I came to this city on the 3rd of June 1981 on the pretext of a job that was offered to me and when I reached and landed, uh, got down at Viti station, I discovered there was no job. It was just a hoax. And I had left a proper job uh, in the sense of a teacher in, uh, in the Lucknow University uh, in Rama. I had no place to go. They had said they will send somebody. They had said they will send some, some because I will get 5,000 rupees for this job. It was a teaching job in a kind of an act, acting school. And there I was standing and nobody to pick me up. So I uh, called up a friend of mine, Swahas Khanje, and I said, I have to live with you for at least seven days. He said, Saad din se zyada nahi sakte. He was practical because... Then I took a place uh, in Bandra East, which was supposed to be with my students who are so-called students of my uh, place, three of them. My landlady was a dhoban. So she used to sleep in the kitchen and we four used to be in a, in a room, that kind of a small room. But ironically, my address was Anupam Kher 2 by 15, Kher Wadi, Kher Nagar, Kher Road, Band <laughs> So I think that these are all signs of which we have So, um, uh, and I don't want to glorify my struggle, I don't want to sort of romanticize my struggle, but I've gone through the grind of being a nobody to being somebody. Uh, so I have don't want to say that in Bandra East, when I was thrown out, then I spent nights on the railway platforms, etc., etc. But I also talk about it so that other people get inspired. That bad times do not remain, like good times don't remain. So I, I in the, at the end of 30 years, if I can be um, inspirational in somebody's life, that's why one talks about one's miseries that one go through. But also because of my miseries, I stayed with my optimism and whatever I am today is because of my optimism and hard work.